I was really convinced that like Burbank was going to be fantastic. Doing Burbank with a layover to LaGuardia, that was the craziest trip. I really was determined to do like a local airport because I just didn't want to deal with LAX. So I went to Ontario and got a layover from there and then flew into LaGuardia. I'm on Madison in 76. I have come to the conclusion making the effort or taking a car, just sucking it up and taking a car straight to LAX, getting on the plane, taking a direct flight, go into LaGuardia. That's the best way to come into New York from California. My hello from New York. Um, to complain a little bit about. There's a lot of taxis still. at Burbank now and um, most flights have been canceled. The winds were like between 40 and 75 miles an hour and honestly we were just sitting on the plane and it was like shaking like as if it was a bus. So I'm actually pretty thankful that we didn't fly but I'm exhausted, exhausted and I can't wait to go home and take a nap get some breakfast and and then rethink, you know, and then fly out tomorrow when it's like easier. So that's the story right now. And um, what a morning. Because I got up at like four, so I'm, I'm done. I'm just gonna do some packing and I'm gonna I'm supposed to get a haircut tonight with Zoe. Um, it's gonna be like a it's a student cut. I've done this before, but I'm hoping that it's a little bit higher quality um, in LA. It's in Pasadena and I'll let you know how it goes. And I do have something in mind, like a, a slight bob. I know it's like, I kind of like it long sometimes, but the hair grows. So we're gonna do that. I'm just packing up some essentials right now. Next chapter, and so that's what I'm doing. So powders, pills, wires. Okay, I think I'm just gonna take the smaller, excuse me, travel flap. I'm gonna take this. This is just like a bag. But instead of taking a million and one bags, I'm gonna take this one so that I can use it in New York. We're standing outside. No, let's just go in. <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> okay, there she is. <laughs> Born again. <laughs> uh, we're just going to get our hair cut. <laughs> I'm feeling like a little disheveled, but I think this will be nice because we've had a long, crazy day with crypto and <laughs> packing, and Zoe looks like she had a long day too. Yes. Okay, I'm sitting in the chair. 
sandwich over there. <laughs> a little layers in the back, and then just a little off the bottom, some purple shampoo, a little bang trim, and be good to go. <laughs> okay, here's, here's me with my head in a hole. So I'm in front of the Paul Mitchell hair cutting school. It's pretty cute. I like it. I think she did a good job and it was $21. I mean, it's $21. Can you beat that? Like, I don't think so. <laughs> and uh, you know what? Paul Mitchell, it's a good name and I feel like the instructors are like really on top of it and I just got like a really good stylist and um, so I'm happy and it's a little short but it grows right it's just hair I'm trying to decide on which coat to bring now here's my dilemma okay I can bring my big coat and just be like completely tucked in warm not have to worry about layers because honestly i just have like a long sleeve shirt with this coat or even like a t-shirt and i would be completely set this is like this is like a coat to be like going into the tundra like seriously when i was in chicago it was it was all i needed and some warm shoes you know um and i love this coat because has these really cool, <laughs> they're like magnets and they just, sometimes they get stuck to like steel doors and stuff, but they just make me feel like completely like a sardine, like one of those fish with the salt that you just pack in. So that is my New York coat, but I'm already sweating. Um, <laughs> so... That is my New York coat and I'm already sweating. So the issue is, if I take it to New York, do I leave it there? Am I bringing it back? Then what am I wearing if I'm not wearing my coat back? You know, just adds a little bit of complication. But I think, well, I think what I'll do is check the weather. So I'm gonna check the weather. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it off. <laughs> Let me check the weather. The weather in New York is, hang on, weather, I know this is like fascinating, right? Okay, New York right now is, yeah, I think I might leave it. I think I might leave it here and then just wear something else, you know? So I'm probably gonna opt for this one. It, it can be warm. I could like wrap a sweater around me or a scarf and this could be like layers and the leather is warm. lovely relationship with her mom and I just uh, sometimes I'll just notice a moment and I'll just pick up my camera and uh, this was one of those those moments and um, so I thought it would be nice to put it into a frame and bring it you call me last night
This time, I really hadn't, I hadn't been meaning to ship it, but I, <laughs> I had a whole thing with the, the size of the photos, and anyway, I didn't get to ship it. I'm going to bring it in person. I just thought it would be really nice to remember that. And this cute little frame. And I'm going to put it in here. And this is where the movie magic happens. It's kind of neat, right? I know this bookshelf they have and maybe they can put it small enough where they can just put it somewhere good. I was trying to get this card set up and it was just taking a really long time. I finally did it. Um, I think part of the complication was that they actually do have like pretty high security, um, which I was thankful for on one hand. The other, I had my phone stolen in Portland last year six months ago and that's a whole nother story if anyone is interested in hearing about that story give me a shout out and I will make a video all about how I had my phone stolen in Portland um but anyway I had this phone number and <laughs> it had to like sync with my phone and the verification with the card and on and on so finally did that and I have to say it was a satisfying moment when I went to the store and was able to use my crypto uh, as if it was fiat, right? So like buying things with this crypto was like kind of mind blowing and very exciting. I know this is a very controversial topic and um, I'm interested. So. Um, so I've just been exploring that a little bit. chance to pick up a few things. Oh, and graduation photo. It's a little early, but I'm going to bring it to my parents and my mother-in-law so they have it when she graduates and some backup pictures. Of course, because why not? All right.
trying to come with me? 